Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome back to my channel. I'm Michael Rock and today I'll show you an easy way how to make tests in Classin. Let's get started. <laughs> feature in Classin that allows you to check how do all your students memorize material in your class. It's not hard to adjust it, but there are some small details and moments that I'd like to show you and also share a little bit of my experience. Okay, so the first thing I want to show you today is how to position all the stuff in the screen. And in order to do that, I'll divide the screen into three different areas, like this. And as you can see, the first area is the largest one, and that's the area where we're gonna position our test. Okay, the second area is perfect for a selector, and it's a little bit white, because selector has two different shapes. And the third area is quite small, there you can position some small additional stuff, like timer. So, why is it important to keep all these areas divided? because in that case, you'll not cover your test with a selector and your students would be able to see everything clear. Hooray! And I call this video an easy way to make tests in class in, cause right now we're gonna make this template based on the same structure where you just need to fill the gaps with questions and answers. So yeah, here it is. It's some kind of a cell that has everything inside already with perfect measures. And depending on how many questions do you have in your test, you can copy this cell as many times as you want. So adjusting any kind of test for you will become a quite easy task since this moment. And yeah, also let me show you how it probably can look like. All right, guys, I hope it was helpful for you. So you can check the link down below in the description where you can download the EDB file that we created today. If you haven't watched my previous video yet, please do it right now, because I'm sure if you work with EDB files, it will save you a lot of time. And if you enjoyed this video, please hit the subscribe button, because soon I'll post more and more videos about Classin. Also, if you have any questions about Classin, feel free to leave them down in the comment section, and I'll try to answer them as soon as possible. Have a great day and see you soon.